At present day, near Lim Shu Kang, a group of young Singaporeans are already working on ideas for farms of the future. Aqualita builds infrastructure to farm fish in small spaces. Systems developed here could be applied at Lim Chu Kang when the master plan comes into fruition. We have pioneered this uh, recirculating aquaculture system, RAS, which we have shrunken down into a 20-foot container. So everything that you see in a fish farm is found in this small little shipping container. So currently in the system, we are breeding an Australian fish called the jade perch. So the jade perch is roughly about 300 to 400 grams upon harvest. So based on that, we can actually breed an estimated up to 4,000 jade perches in a single RAS system. Operations at this fish farm are almost entirely automated. My job is basically to integrate the mechanical and automation systems together to create a remote access and control system so we can minimize the manpower required on site at any given time and to look after and watch the fish. Container fish farming has many merits for land-scarce Singapore. And it's modular, which makes it highly scalable. This is the 6-in-1, the scaled-up version of it. So basically, in this system, we have six fish containers and one central filtration system. So in this system, we estimate we can grow up to about 10,000 kilograms of fish, much more than we can do in our single standalone container. We hope we can demonstrate to traditional fish farmers that it is possible to incorporate technology and maximize and improve their farming methods. So I actually have a mechanical engineering background, but at home, I have a personal passion for marine life. So I thought aquaculture is the perfect avenue for me to merge these two parts of my life together. And I believe working in this sustainable technology space, aquaculture gives me a lot of opportunities and there's a lot of potential for growth in this sector. And I would like to be a pioneer to create a more sustainable future.